One of the things that has worried me as time rolled along is what's going to happen when I pass on to better pastures. And so the Royals were worried to me as to who would be handling the team. When he knew that he was going to die, he decided that what he wanted to do was to gift the team to Kansas City and make sure that it would stay here for the foreseeable future. Under the complex succession plan, Mr. K donated the team to the Greater Kansas City Community Foundation. It was instructed to sell the Royals with two stipulations. One, the team must remain in Kansas City. And two, the proceeds from the sale must be donated to local charities. It was the best of all worlds. You keep the club, it goes to someone who will retain local ownership, and also the community gets, in a sense, the receipts for needed projects. As a show of good faith, Mr. Kaufman then asked for the community to raise $50 million for team operating expenses. Within days, the money began pouring in. Children contributed their weekly allowances. Corporations donated large checks, and Mrs. Kaufman started the ball rolling by kicking in a million dollars. He was very touched by it, and the support was, was overwhelming, and everybody stepped up. And, you know, if you're doing something that is the right thing to do and a good thing to do, then what you find is that people generally will line up and support that.